Hi, welcome to US Most Read. This is a breaking news. UPS can come to a standstill. It would be the first work stoppage since a walkout by 185,000 workers crippled the company a quarter century ago. With the world relying on everything delivered everywhere all the time, a brewing UPS strike looms over the delivery chain mechanism. As for the latest stats, a staggering 24 million packages UPS shipped on an average day, which roughly sums about a quarter of all US parcel volume. Overall, UPS has 350,000 unionized workers represented by the team centers, and they together deliver a million more packages every day than it did just five years ago. But now the situation is fast changing. UPS has seen a tremendous growth during these years. Annual profits at UPS in the past two years are close to three times what they were before the pandemic. Shareholders are happy as $8.6 billion has been given to them in the form of dividends and stock buybacks in 2022 and forecast another $8.5 billion this year. Then why is UPS heading towards a strike? The answer is this. UPS workers are putting all efforts tirelessly that has resulted in the growth numbers too. But since the last contract was ratified in 2018, there has been emerging disapprovals among the workers concerning the benefits and payments. Union members have vehemently rejected the contract that was offered in 2018. In addition to addressing part-time pay and what workers say is excessive overtime, the union wants to eliminate a contract provision that created two separate hierarchies of workers with different pay cycles, hours and benefits. Amidst the growing turmoil, it was even reported that last year, workers rejected a candidate to lead the Teamsters, favoured by longtime union head James Hopper, instead choosing the more combative Sean O'Brien. Earlier this year, there was a gathering where dozens of UPS locals met with Teamsters leadership and O'Brien then had said, we are going into these negotiations with a clear message to UPS that we are not going past August 1. Well, if the disagreements are not settled at the earliest, the delivery of products may not sustain and then who knows, Americans may need to put aside more time to shop like they used to do before. That's it for now. We leave you with this thought right here. Please do like, share and subscribe our channel to get more updates. Thank you.